How come did Texas A&M men's basketball lose to Murray State? Texas A&M was number 24 in the country. 24. And they've lost 88 to 79. Sure, you could say they've been outscored in the first half and the second half, but there's more, more to dive into than just that. First of all, Murray State made 25 shots out of 50, 10 for 22 from three, 28 for 36 on free throws, 37 rebounds, 15 assists, 8 steals, 4 blocks, 17 turnovers, 22 fouls. Texas A&M had, some, of course, like I said, 79 points, but 27 for 71 on from the field, 6 for 27 on free throws, 19 for 6, 28 on on threes, 42 rebounds. They had rebounded them. They had 12 assists. 10 steals, which is more steals than the other team. Three blocks, which is one less. They had only 11 turnovers and 26 fouls. So, you could point out that they missed too many shots, honestly. And they only had, Murray State only had 10 points off the bench, which is not that much. Especially when A&M had like 15 plus 12, that's 27, plus 2, that's 29 points off the bench. So, what is going to happen next for Texas for Murray State? First of all, they're in a tournament. They are playing UMass next. That's today, actually. That's currently 2 and 1 after they beat Colorado. So, and granted. They would have to play, depending on results. I'm gonna to have to go look at the what happened in the other, because not all the teams are ranked in this. So bear with me on this. Looking up what happened. I know Charlotte. I mean, depending on results in Royal Beach. Okay, Tulsa beat Loyola Chicago, so they're on the same side as UMass and UMass for sure, as well as Murray State. While I believe the Mountain West Boise State lost. They lost to Charlotte 54 to 42. So Charlotte's on the other side of the bracket as well. So Murray State, depending on results, it's gonna play either Charlotte or or Tulsa. So while Texas A&M is gonna play Colorado next, and depending on results, Boise State or the Louisville Chicago that's explaining the next two games for both those teams. I mean, for the tournament. I mean, and I expect Texas A&M to not be ranked next week. Don't be shocked if they're not ranked. Because, I mean, you lose once, you should be not in anymore. But we'll have to wait and see what really happens. But after the tournament for Texas A&M. And Texas A&M plays at 11 a.m. this morning on ESPNU Central Time. After that game, they actually played DePaul. That's currently undefeated. That's after the tournament. And then SMU. So that's after the two games after that tournament. While Murray State, after this tournament, like I said, already explained who they're going to probably play the next two games. All right, they're going to play today and then whoever they play next. But for Murray State, after that, they play UTC, which stands for Chattanooga, or Chattanooga. Chattanooga, that's currently one and two. 
and they play Illinois State. So that's explaining the schedules for both those teams after the tournament and even including the tournament. Anyways, if you like this content, hit the like and subscribe button. I'll see you guys later. It's going to be the point of subscribing. There's no more by the end of this year or sometime in the future.